So in this Cyberpunk 2077 video, I'm going to show you how you can get one of the brand new Phantom Liberty DLC vehicles. It's as far as I'm aware, the only new bike in this DLC. It's called the Melina Mobile, it's amazing and today guys I'll run you through all the choices you need to make to get this thing. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so this is an amazing bike which is rewarded to you upon you making the right choices within a side mission called Dazed and Confused. Now this side mission will pop up for you as you progress the game's main story and complete other side missions and side gigs for Mr. Hands. So do what you gotta do guys and progress. Now he will eventually send you a message, Mr. Hands that is, about a brain dance celeb named Alina. Make sure you accept this offer. So this dazed and confused side mission starts right here on the map. So within this mission you meet Shank, who sends you out to get Lena to do a brain dance shoot. So eventually guys you go and wait for Melina. Now I ain't 100% sure here, but the choices I made may be needed, so pick the following choices as I did. So the first one you have, uh, you'll select, you found them like this. Then guys tell her that you're a BD scout. Then tell her she will be co-starring with Kerry Uridine. Now from this point guys you'll end up back with Shank and Alina. Here you pretend to be the director. And well there are three choices you can make here. Now firstly I have done all three choices. The top two choices of tell him that he's your sister and convince him that he is a clone created by the FIA will see you being rewarded the baby boomer iconic baseball bat which when this side mission ends she sends you a message and tells you that she left it at the bar now the third choice of send tools a letter here your lines if you are a female V I believe this will allow you to grab her tank top which will be downstairs from this room now I'm a male V, I never got this tank top, I believe it could be something that may arrive later on or it is female V's only. Again I tried all three options. So my last option I chose and continued my playthrough with was the top option of tell him he's your sister. This I was rewarded that new baseball bat uh, but I did go on to have a continued back and forth with Lena over the progress of my remaining playthrough of the Phantom Liberty DLC. This is a completely different conversation from the message she sends you about the reward she has left you. She contacted me again after this. Now the choices back and forth I made you can see on screen now. Again I'm not sure if these make any difference but make sure you pick the same ones I picked. Now eventually guys she will message you telling you that she's left you a present. Keep in mind this happened to me just before I was about to start the last mission within my playthrough here of picking sides with Songbird. At this point I completed all gigs, I completed most side missions, I believe there's a couple left over. But it was not long after I'd done and completed the mission, the side mission for Mr. Hands called Run This Town, which ties in with the main story. So yes guys, keep all this in mind. Again, this is an amazing superbike, one of my new favourite vehicles in this game and this is how I got it. So yes, keep the choices I made in mind if you haven't done this dazed and confused side mission yet, as it could end up you being rewarded this superbike or not. Again I ain't sure if the other choices you make will result in you getting this bike, all I know is through my playthrough and the options I picked I was rewarded it. If anyone else can confirm this down below please do let us know. Guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys I will see you on that next one.